so it's been quite a time that I have never vlogged or tried to film anything because of the lockdown and all the shit going around. Mayo and bread. So one more addition is this mustard which we would need but just a little bit. This is the tuna. I'm going to open it but I've, I've been saving this for my cat as well so obviously he would be eating it. Some of it. And rest of the stuff I'm going to use it. This is how you open the canned tuna. Nice. Zen's going to love it. Zen? Shh. All of the yeah, water, right? Water. We don't want it to be watery at all. And some pieces I will keep for Zen. Yep. Spring water tuna. And this, the entire stuff goes into making, fixing up the tuna sandwich. Ooh, ooh, molly. This looks so freaking awesome. So the experiment is successful. <laughs> he wants to. Ah, no, 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 don't put your face in the tuna. Zen, no, wait. <laughs> He doesn't want the water, he's so smart. He wants the actual tuna. Yeah. Zen, no, that's, we that's are preparing. our food. That's, we are preparing a now recipe. Now he's going to go mad. You have to give him some tuna right away. Yeah, I'm, I'm giving him. I'm gonna mix soon. Let's add mayo in this. Please not drink this water. It has lots of tuna inside. Come here. You're gonna love it. You don't need salt, do you? Yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. Nonetheless. He is thinking, how are you guys eating my food? It's apocalypse time, baby. You can eat anything. <laughs> so you can pick up any mayo, egg or anything. So we've just, just made this mix for the sandwich. And now next thing what we're gonna do is get the bread open and so somehow we have managed to you know with help of my wife we just managed to make oh it does Grill. have it, it does have garlic. masala in that it has like, garlic it's a garlic bread basically yeah. it has masala in that so let's try and And this is my staple food. What do you think? Yeah. Like, I love this type of food. I don't know about the others. I don't know. Like, typical Indian food, I cannot digest it anymore. Because of um, all the things going around and stuff. I don't know. I, I, this is my comfort food. There's a tuna sandwich with... Tuna on white, no crust, right? I don't know. How is it, tuna? No crust. Let's get this side as well. Wow. You don't want to make sure you don't want to waste any of it. And see, no shit. See, now your sandwich is ready. Almost ready. Yeah, we can make it four. Yeah. You have to not go like this. You have to go like this with this knife. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. This works better. Yeah. So, this is your part. No, I'll take the corner. Yeah, whatever. Just let me just make another cut. Yeah. And we are through. Yeah. Yeah, that's perfect. You think that's it? That's the home brewed backyard tuna sandwich. So this was it. This was the quick, the messiest one. I know I'm not a chef or something, but I'm just trying to, you know, make something out there, put food together. And thankfully, this time the food was uh, the food for cat and food for us is the same. <laughs> no, kidding. But anyways, I'm gonna taste this sandwich right now, and let's check out how it really feels like in the act in the. How it's turned out, I'm, I'm sure it's it's not as good as the professional ones, but let's see. Hmm, it's amazing. I'm a good cook, not <laughs> chef. Good cook. Good cook with the canned tuna. <laughs> yeah, good cook with the canned tuna. So canned tuna, spring water one, not Next brine. Next time we'll use the brine. We'll, We'll use, we'll try everything. Yeah. We'll try brine, we'll try olive oil. What's it? You yeah. wanna taste? Yeah, taste. And I want your reaction. Mm, nice. Really? Cut. <laughs>